The weather every 10 minutes with KIMT Storm Team 3 meteorologist Sean McAday. Sean, good morning. What are you tracking? Good morning. We are talking about a nice opportunity to get outside today. It's considering the fact that what's to come is a lot of heat and humidity. Highs well into the 80s, dew point 70s. Today, we're not there yet. It's just going to be a nice summer day, but not without a chance for some rain. Right now, out the door, temperatures are in the low 60s as skies continue to clear. If you're looking east, especially from Rochester, you can still see clouds, but looking west, we do have sunshine and clear skies coming our way for most of the day. Temps right now, low to mid 60s, dew points just about right there, a touch lower, so there is some humidity overhead. It's not much. That's good news because later this week it is going to be swampy. I'm <laughs> forget about it. All right, today is a better day to get outside, even despite the fact that we're dealing with some raindrops here and there this afternoon. Just have a rain jacket on hand just in case. You're going outside for a run today. The best time to do that probably around lunch when we're not dealing with that afternoon chance for rain yet. Temperatures aren't too too hot. They never really get too too hot this today. But still, mid 70s around lunch is pretty good with plenty of sunshine to go around. This afternoon, that's when there is going to be that isolated chance for a shower or storm kicking up. Just like this past weekend, it probably won't be everywhere. For example, Rochester kind of avoided most of the rain over the weekend, but other spots saw several rounds of showers. It's just a continuation of that pattern today. So some of us get some raindrops, but it won't last too long. More spotty and brief. Uh, you can get outside on the water this afternoon. It's a good day for that. Wear some sunscreen and just be mindful of that chance for rain, which right now I have it about 40% no matter where you are in the area today. So here's a look at one o'clock. This is a latest computer model run, so I haven't shown this yet this morning. One o'clock, nothing. It's after about three o'clock where we start to see some stuff pop up. This computer model actually doesn't kick up anything after three o'clock. That's interesting. Here it is four, five, six o'clock now when you're starting to see a couple of brief spotty thunderstorms and showers get kicked up and by eight o'clock poof they're gone so they're up and they're down and that's it so does do all of us see the rain today no but some of us do and some of us will so just have that rain jacket on hand just in case otherwise it's a beautiful day to get outside uh, tomorrow another nice day but it's starting to get warmer wednesday is going to be our best chance of rain this week a couple of thunderstorms again swinging through the area and then thursday friday saturday sunday look at these temps we're climbing through the 80s. Dew points, once you get to dew points of like 70, that is just too humid for a lot of folks. And we just are getting warmer and more Florida-like by Sunday. So get outside today, get outside tomorrow. Wednesday, I do think in the afternoon, those thunderstorms could be a bit more widespread perhaps than today. That's something we're going to keep an eye on. And then that towards your extended weekend, it's that July weather, that pool weather that I think folks wanted last weekend. They're going to get it this weekend. Well, hey, there's that at least. You know, if you're yeah. going to deal with all that mugginess, at least it's a good time to take a dip. I agree. All right. Thanks, Sean.